Welcome back. Are you ready for today's matchup? It's going to be super fun. It'll be seahorse based. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. All right, the ideas come from Ella Taylor. She would like us to mash up seahorse and spaghetti. And the second idea is from Sam Finale from California, which is going to be a banana seahorse. Let's get started. Okay, I think I'll start with Sam's idea because that's going to be a little easier. The uh, seahorse spaghetti is going to be, woo, give me one of my more complicated drawings. All right, I'll make this vertical. So Sam, we're going to start um, with the banana shape. Oh, I almost forgot. There's no erasing because everything you create will be perfect and beautiful all the time. And um, if I draw really, really fast, um, please just pause the video. And lastly, you don't have to draw these characters exactly how I'm illustrating them. All right, let's draw the banana. Okay, let's first draw sort of like the tip of the banana, then add one curved line and another curved line with the banana. There you go, you can see the banana, then add a banana detail over there. Okay, let's draw the head of the seahorse. Draw sort of like a loop like this. Now let's draw the snout, which I love to draw. Draw a curved line there and sort of like a circle, it kind of looks like a trumpet. Then let's draw the base of the head. There you go. Then add a circle inside over here. Okay. Let's give the seahorse a smile. There you go. Let's draw one big eye and a smaller one. Then add two letter C's inside. One, two, fill them in. One, two, fill them in. Okay, you can sort of see the seahorse now. And after this, let's add some fins. So seahorses have nice fancy fins. So add a curved line, then add some waves like that. If you want, you can add some lines. Okay, then add a similar shape here for the second fin. Okay, we are almost done. Okay, let's add the seahorse's mane. I don't know what they're called, but they're kind of nice and fancy. There you go. Then let's add the curly bottom. So add sort of like a coil, like this, spring-like. It's kind of like spring already. There you go. We have drawn the um, the seahorse banana. I'll sign this for Sam. There you go. All right, we are now going to draw Ella's spaghetti seahorse. Hmm, it's going to be a bit of a challenge. Okay, here's my thought. Let's draw the seahorse first. So let's draw the head. It's like this, similar to what we've drawn earlier. And again, the snout kind of looks like a trumpet. Okay, then draw the bottom part. There you go. Let's add the elegant neck. There you go. Add the circle inside the trumpet-like shape. Not a surprise. Add one big eye and a little one. Before we draw the eyeballs, let's give her some eyelashes. Okay. Add one letter C here and another one over there. Then fill them in. Remember, you can color your seahorses later on. Then let's give the seahorse a smile. Okay. Now let's draw the body. So draw sort of like a bump here and a curve back like that. If I'm drawing too fast, please pause the video. Then add the curl at the bottom. Just like that. One curl. Okay. Now let's add the fins. Similar shape as earlier. All right, Woo. now let's add the spaghetti details. You know what I think? I'm going to make the main like thing spaghetti. So draw these long tube-like shapes representing pasta or the spaghetti. It's gonna be a really amazing looking 
seahorse, maybe one that curves. All right, I'm drawing this really fast again. You can pause the video. You don't have to look perfect. Go. Another one that curves. There you go. Hmm, this is fun. Another pasta. And another pasta over here. Spaghetti. Another spaghetti here. I'm drawing this really fast. You may want to draw this a little bit more carefully later on. There you go. More pasta. Okay, how about if we create, add some pasta texture inside a body as well, but I'll draw her belly first. I believe seahorses have this cute belly right there. Okay, if you want, this may be really time consuming. Let's add some more pasta shapes. One here, another one over here. So this seahorse is really made out of spaghetti. It's really emphasize the spaghetti portion. One over here, another one over there. This is so much fun to draw. Very spaghetti-like. Continue the spaghetti shape here, there, and continue it up here. Maybe we want to curl around. So really, she is made out of spaghetti. Again, it doesn't have to be perfect. I'm loving all the texture and how she looks. Wow, spaghetti seahorse. There she is, a spaghetti formed seahorse. I'll sign this for Ella. I will turn off the projector. Okay, Ella and Sam, when you get a chance, please email me your address at smileyb at bataclan.com. Sam, I know your address because you're married to my cousin in California, Desiree. Um, also, if you have not done so, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and also hit the bell icon so you'll know when the next episode is released. And um, this is it for now. I hope this clicker works. See you tomorrow. Bye.